How you doing guys? So, um, I've done a lot of stuff, a lot of videos and everything for Facebook and obviously YouTube. But everyone's asking me about the jab. Because every coach is different. Everyone's got their own little preference and style. This is how I like to see the jab. So, this is my boxing stance, which I've done before. I'm going to go into my boxing stance. This is how I hold my dark stance. So from there, first of all, okay, your elbow. Too many boxers, some of them should do this. Can you see that? It's no good, all right? Because if you jab from there and bring your fist back this way, it's gonna be just as slow as throwing your right hand. It's the same amount of distance, all right? If you lead with your left, like I do, and you're orthodox, there, your hand comes forward. Your elbow's gotta come straight in front. You keep your chin in from there. Don't have your hand all the way back. Same thing against too far to travel. There, that's the way I like to position it. This way. Can you see that? It's half cocked, all, all ready to go. Obviously, if someone comes in from long range to short very quickly, you've got to be aware of a hook. But fighting from long range, you're safe like this, okay? So your hand's half cocked. So therefore, it's going to be quick, all right? Now, with my jab, I prefer speed than power. Because if you do a really powerful jab, that hand's gonna come slow or your hook's gonna come slow. The faster you throw your jab, the faster your cross is coming or the faster your hook's coming. So from there, in order to do this, all right, this is the big power shot and so is your hook. But this jab from there, you've got to try and imagine your arm as a sock. Into that sock's a cue ball. So there's no power at all. It's just pure speed. There, boom, boom. So the faster that's coming, the faster your right hand's coming. Okay? It's as simple as that. So from there, it's half cocked and it's loose. Speed. Speed will beat power all day long because the faster you hit something as well, the harder it is. Do you understand? So from there, your hands up this way. From there, straight down the pipe this way. Straight down there. There, boom, turn at the last moment, all right? And the same thing again from there. Your hands are suddenly open from there, and they engage, they lock just before impact. There, there. If you're tight, it slows you up, okay? Hands in front, your elbow goes in front, shoulder this way, your arms totally relaxed, nice and loose. Engage your fist before impact, and that will give you <laughs> tremendous speed. Boom, ready to throw that rear hand. Boom, ready to throw your rear hook. That's the way I like to see a jab done properly. All right, Jay, thank you.